Searching for the best motherboard for the Ryzen 5 7600? The AMD Ryzen 5 7600 is the entry point to the AM5 platform. It has excellent single and multi-thread performance, making it one of the best gaming and productivity CPUs at around $200. Taking into account the price of this budget CPU, I've done an extensive review of the top motherboards for the 7600 and rated them according to VRM design, aesthetics, features, and value for money. Price, information, and all motherboards mentioned in the video are available in the description. So let's get started. Number 3. AS Rock B650M PG Riptide Wi-Fi Best Budget Motherboard for Ryzen 5 7600 The standard for AMD's 7000 series motherboards is high, and AS Rock is not taking any chances. Time and time again, they have released excellent motherboards for the AM5 socket, and the AS Rock PG Riptide is no exception, especially given the features they offer at a really affordable price. The motherboard is packed with a powerful 12 plus 2 plus 1 phase VRM. This configuration can easily run the 7600 even if you do extreme overclocking with this chip. In fact, this motherboard will have no issues in running an overclocked 7800X or a stock 7950X. The VRM heatsinks are beefy and cover all 12 VRM capacitors to ensure that the board always stays under 80 degrees Celsius. The AS Rock B650 MPG Riptide motherboard is well built thanks to its six-layer PCB design. It also doesn't have that over-the-top gamer look, which is a big plus in my opinion. This board will fit nicely in any setup, especially if you're going for an all-black theme. Also, don't let its micro ATX size fool you because it's got four PCIe expansion slots, two PCIe 4 times 16 and two PCIe 3 times 1. Usually, we find three or more than three PCIe slots on full-sized ATX motherboards, so for AS Rock to fit four on a micro ATX motherboard is nothing short of a serious flex. What's more impressive is that this motherboard has a PCIe 5.0 M2 slot because it is quite hit or miss to find a PCIe 5.0 M2 slot at this price point, and the second M2 slot is running at PCIe 4.0 speeds instead of PCIe 3.0, which most manufacturers opt for. Even the memory support is excellent, and the AS Rock B650 MPG Riptide can easily run 6,000 mega transfers per second DDR5 RAM with complete stability. AS Rock claims that this motherboard can support RAM speeds of up to 7,200 mega transfers per second and beyond with overclock, but that needs to be tested further. The rear I.O. is very good in my opinion, and features features a 2.5 gigabit Ethernet port, Wi-Fi 6E, Bluetooth 5.2, BIOS flashback button, HDMI 2.1, DisplayPort 1.4, and standard audio jacks. There are also a total of seven USB Type A ports. Four of them are USB 2.0, two of them are USB 3.2 Gen 1, and one is a USB 3.2 Gen 2 port, along with a USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type C port. AS Rock also offers Thunderbolt 4 support on this motherboard, which really impressed me, and I feel like more manufacturers need to incorporate this into their motherboards as well. As the demand for workstation PCs increases, Thunderbolt will become a deciding factor for many to run their high-speed devices. The market for budget AM5 motherboards is quite healthy and competitive. We are seeing great offerings from all vendors. Some of the best budget motherboards are the Gigabyte B650M DS3H and AS Rock B650 Pro RS, and they usually come as the first options for many when they are looking to build their next AMD-based PC. However, when comparing any other budget motherboards, board at a price range between $150 and $200, the AS Rock V650 MPG Riptide is a substantially better motherboard. The VRM configuration is twice as powerful as the Gigabyte DS3H, and the Pro RS isn't that much better with its eight phases. Apart from the VRMs, Gigabyte is one-upped by AS Rock in terms of I.O. and expandability. The AS Rock V650 MPG Riptide makes it impossible to look elsewhere for a better motherboard on a budget. At this point, my only nitpicks with this motherboard are that it does not have a clear CMOS button included in the rear I.O., and there is a need for a few more USB 3.2 ports, even if it means removing a couple of USB 2.0 ports. The audio jacks are only a standard 7.13 jack array, so a complete 5 jack array with an optical S PDIF port would have been ideal. Still, even without those features, the AS Rock B650 MPG Riptide is a killer budget AM5 motherboard, and all in all offers everything you would probably expect from much more expensive motherboards. It has strong VRM excellent cooling, PCIe 5.0, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and four PCIe expansion slots, all in a single micro ATX form factor. It's the perfect budget motherboard for the Ryzen 5 7600. Number 2. AS Rock X670E Steel Legend Best High-End Motherboard for Ryzen 5 7600. For the second spot, we have another AS Rock motherboard. I'd say that AS Rock is pretty bold to call this motherboard a legend, but I don't think they're quite off on that. What makes this one of the best motherboards available in the market to pair 
compare with the Ryzen 5 7600 is that it is complete with all the necessities. It has an excellent VRM design, 16 plus 2 plus 1 phase at 60 amps, so running even the 7950X at high clocks won't be an issue. A rather rare feature of the Steel Legend is its two Ethernet ports, one being 1 gigabyte and the other 2 gigabyte. This board also comes with an insane number of USB ports. I counted a total of 12 in the back, with support for 5 more in the front. Perhaps my favorite feature of this motherboard is the inclusion of a graphic card holder. This included holder is perfect for giant GPUs like the RX 7900 XTX or the RTX 4090 so that they don't say. I wish more vendors included this nowadays. This is truly the best value seekers board. Reliable power delivery, sturdy board design, overloaded with features, and an excellent price to match. What more can one want? For around the price of the AS Rock X670E Steel Legend, the other boards I considered that offer a similar experience are the Gigabyte X670 Gaming XAX and the MSI Pro X670 P Wi-Fi. I also saw a handful of boards from Asus and AS Rock themselves. In the end, I went with the AS Rock X670 Steel Legend over the other affordable X670 boards. All of these boards can comfortably supply power to the 7600 to run at higher clocks, but it came down to features. Unlike the Steel Legend, most boards in this price range don't offer Gen 5 support on the Time 16 slot. All in all, I needed a board that would yield the most value. Being a budget board does not mean it just needs to be cheap and cut corners. At the end, I really wanted to recommend the Gigabyte X670 Gaming XAX for the 7600. However, right now, the price of the Steel Legend is just $30 more than the Gaming X, and it overshadows the Gaming X in terms of features. Number 1. MSI Meg B650 Tomahawk Wi-Fi Our top choice. MSI Meg B650 Tomahawk Wi-Fi is a budget-friendly motherboard that pairs exceptionally well with the Ryzen 5 7600. This motherboard strikes a balance between cost and performance, making it an ideal choice for those who want to maximize their budget without compromising on quality. The board has a minimalistic aesthetic with brushed accents and simple line patterns, replacing the previous black and white military styling. The absence of flashy chipset info text gives it a sleek, stealthy look. One of the standout features of this motherboard is its robust VRMs. MSI has opted for a 14 plus 2 plus 1 configuration with the CPU-oriented stages, delivering a combined 1120 amps. This is more than enough for the Ryzen 5 7600, which won't fully tap into this power. The cooling system is straightforward, yet effective, with tall, tiered heat sinks and diagonal cuts for improved air circulation. While the B650 is AMD's entry-level motherboard tier, it still offers access to DDR5 RAM. However, the B650 Tomahawk Wi-Fi does not support PCIe 5.0, which shouldn't be a concern for most users at this price point, as Gen 5 SSDs are still relatively new and the latest GPUs don't fully utilize PCIe 4.0. In terms of storage, the motherboard offers three slots for PCIe 4.0 SSDs, two of which have heatsinks. It also includes six SATA 3 ports for legacy storage. The absence of armoring between the Time 16 slots provides a clear view of the CMOS battery, and the second full-length slot supports PCIe 4.0, albeit limited to Times 4. The PCIe 3.0 Times 1 slot can be used for capture cards or dedicated sound cards. Although the board's excellent ALC 4080-backed audio solution makes this unnecessary for most users. The motherboard features six case fan headers for cooling and additional headers for RGB strips. It also includes two USB 3.2 Gen 1 headers and 10 gigabyte per second USB-C for case I.O. connectivity. The main I.O. is a highlight with 10 USB ports, one of which is 20 gigabytes per second USB-C, 2.5G LAN, and upgraded Wi-Fi 6E antenna connections. The latest versions of HDMI and DisplayPort are also included, along with a 5 plus 1 audio stack and a BIOS flash button for easy updates. In conclusion, the MSI Meg B650 Tomahawk Wi-Fi is a solid choice for the Ryzen 5 7600 if you're on a budget. It offers robust VRMs, effective cooling, and a good range of features. While it lacks PCIe 5.0 support, it more than makes up for it with its other offerings, making it a value-for-money option in the motherboard market. So what do you think? Which of these is the best motherboard for Ryzen 5 7600 for you? Or do you think another motherboard is better? Tell us in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Have an awesome day.